Making an Angel Hair Dubbing Brush by Brad Buzzy. We're going to be using a dubbing brush machine, some side cutters, some thin stainless wire, head cement, and angel hair. We start off by attaching our stainless wire to the one end and securing it, and extending it over and wrapping it around the hook on the other end. Then we'll take a couple spins of the wheel just to secure it. Flip up the table and secure it. I'm going to take a clump of angel hair and break it up into three different sections. Then we're going to fan each section out and lay it on top of our table. You can use all different types of materials and even mix and match the colors and the types of materials. But today, to keep it simple, we're just going to use straight angel hair. Once we've got all the materials laid out, we're going to take the other end of our wire apply a little bit of head cement to it and secure it off. Now we're ready to spin. When I start, I like to just hold down the front part of our brush to get a little bit of tension on the wire. And then once I have enough, I'll drop down the table and finish spinning. On this machine, as we spin, the right post will slowly move outwards because the post has a spring on it that helps keep tension on the wire and it prevents the wire from snapping. We can use a brass brush to comb out the fibers. We really can apply a lot of pressure to the fibers to try to pull them out so that we don't have any trapped fibers and we end up with a nice full brush. Depending on the material you use, you may have to brush out the brush a few times. Now we can disconnect the wire from the machine, use our side cutters or wire cutters, but not your scissors because you will ruin them, to cut off one end of the wire, and then we can just unloop it from the other end. Well, that's the finished brush. As you can see, they're pretty easy to make. You'll be surprised on the different types of materials and combination of materials you can spin. I hope you enjoy it. For more information, you can contact me at buzzfly.com or visit the Atlantic Saltwater Fly Rotters at aswf.info.